Good morning, everybody. It's the start of day 215. Um, just left camp this morning. It's like 715. Plan was to get out at 630, but that 430 alarm did not, not 630, at 6. But that 430 alarm was not cutting it for me this morning. So slept in a little bit longer. And right out of camp, we're climbing up the Mahusik arm because we didn't do it last night. But I feel pretty rested and pretty, uh, pretty hopeful that we're going to make it to town tonight so we can stay in a hostel and get a shower and get up and slug pack a 23 mile day tomorrow. Uh, today's game plan is 17.3 now instead of the 14.9 but uh, I think splitting up the elevation was a pretty good idea and then I'm still pretty sore from all the climbing yesterday through Mahusik Notch. Um, yeah. It kind of lives up to its name. I don't know what I'm saying right now, but it kind of lives up to its name. It was pretty tough and I was grateful that I had uh, one of my tramley here tripod because it would have been really difficult for me to do by myself and probably would have taken me three hours. So we did it in about an hour and 45. And yeah, that's what's up. <laughs> All right, let's get to hiking. Okay, we're going up that. <laughs> oh boy, this is just the start. Good morning, buddy. Oh, he keeps moving away. Oh, there's another one over there. Oh, where's he been over at now? I know. I don't know if y'all can see him. Man, that was so crazy. <laughs> they just came out of nowhere. Also, it's probably a pretty good vantage for what it is. This is 0.5 for pretty much straight up. <laughs> Woo, get that booty burn in today. Woo, we made it to the Mahusik arm, the top of it. It was definitely um, not bad this morning. I feel like it would have been really hard had we done it right after the notch last night. So if you can split your mileage up and stay in the still spot right after the notch and then climb the arm in the morning, I definitely recommend it. So this is the pond and that's the trail. <laughs> wow, this is fun. Okay, so we just caught back up with Nine Lives and Toasty. Uh, at the shelter that they stayed at last night at the top of the arm. And we were trying to figure out, whew, I'm climbing. <laughs> uh, we were trying to figure out a game plan for the next couple days. We needed to resupply, and if we pushed all the way to the 16 or 17 miles that we originally thought, um, we would have gotten there really late, had little time to resupply, and uh, the cabin that we're staying at, the hostel, makes dinner, and they serve it at six. So. It just really wasn't gonna work out. And uh, so now we've adjusted our plan and we're losing nine miles over the next couple of days doing it this way, but uh, we gotta have food. So we did have to change the plan. We're gonna go the 4.6 from this shelter to Grafton Notch, get picked up in and taken to Bethel, which has good food, Good resupply, a lot more, a lot more options there. And then um, the people from the cabin are gonna pick us up around five and uh, take us back there. And then we'll slack pack tomorrow from Grafton Notch forward 21 miles, hopefully. And then, yeah, I think that's the plan. I can't breathe. Everything is just blah. <laughs> but look how beautiful and mossy and green it is. Ooh. Yep. Oh, this is good. So we're going to end up doing like probably eight miles today, I think is what it's going to be about. So maybe not even eight, maybe like seven something. So another low mile day, but I'll get there. I think this is going to be a better plan too for our bodies. We'll be pushing, but not pushing our bodies to their limits and then having to take longer, longer time off. So it is what it is. All right. 
I'm gonna finish climbing this mountain. Woo! We're scaling walls here. A popular trend I'm finding in southern Maine. <laughs> Literally bear crawling up this thing. <sighs> it is windy. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. <laughs> oh man. Look at the pink moss too. It's so pretty. Whoa, I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but look at all the colors. It's so beautiful. I think one, um, or a positive of me having to take so much time off trail is that now I get to see all the beautiful fall colors in Maine and I saw a few in Vermont and I'm really excited about it, it's so pretty. There we go. Oh, it's so nice. And you can see a ridge. What a lovely day now that the clouds are gone. Step on it again. Thin rocks, because I'm going to fill it the next day. Oh, it's springing here. I would too. It just looks like it goes down to a pool down there. Ooh, now that's a waterfall. Oh, that's a swimming hole. If only it were not almost October. <laughs> Could still technically shower in it, I think, if I needed to. Look, it's Popeye. He left a couple days ago. We came to the town of Bethel to uh, find a brewery that had beer and food, and it's closed. So we're going to go resupply and um, go to a diner and then go to the cabin a little bit later. But this yeah. is Bethel, Maine. It's just a little smally town. Just trying to find food now. We found a burger place. It's the move. We're going hard on some french fries. Mm. And beer. <laughs> welcome to welcome to Kelly Hayes' house. <laughs> house for the night. This is my mansion for the night. I have this wonderful private room all to myself. <laughs> And Get in there. Yeah. <laughs> it, has, it has no electricity. Oh, wow. Yeah. But this is nice. Okay, yeah, there uh, are not any lights, but wow. Alrighty, guys. Well, it's the end of day 2.15 or close to the end. It's like 6 p.m. Um, we went seven miles today and, uh, yeah, came into Bethel. Then got picked up from Bethel and brought to the cabin, which is close to Andover. And we're going to slack pack a 20 mile day tomorrow, which will be the biggest mile day I've done in quite a while. But it's nice that I won't have to carry my pack the whole way. Uh, positive for the day is that I'm staying in a hostel and I get a shower and um, I am not stressing too much about miles. I'm trying not to anyways, but now I'm just babbling. Um, yeah, that's pretty much all I got. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe for more. We'll see you soon. <laughs> Dinner. Spinach. Popeye and his spinach. Wow, there's dessert too. Mmm.